Hey guys, my name is David Carson and I'm going to be showing you a simulation which I programmed in Visual C Sharp. So let's get going. I thought I would start my channel with um, something that I created myself. Seeing as it's the first video I'm uploading, feels right. This is basically a simulation. It's got ants in it and the ants run to the food sources pick up the leaves and carry them back to their colony and as they go back they drop pheromones which other ants sense and follow to the food source and as they take food from the food source it depletes and over time it starts it grows back if it's left alone um, if, if I press the control key then it populates the world with lots of trees and colonies all of the objects are populated inside of the world so I can move the camera around independently of the objects. If the colony gets five food then they're able to recruit one more ant so they can add an extra ant to the world. So the more food the colony gets the more ants they get but the ants have a lifespan and when they die they stop moving and can be picked up by other ants and taken back to the colony as food. I also have a, a, a monkey running around. Just, just that's a little New World monkey using using my logo, the face from my logo on a monkey's body running around. I've also got a wasp's nest. The wasps prey on the ants, so they seek out the ants and take them back to the colony or the wasp's nest. And the wasp's nest operates in a very similar way to the ant colonies get five food to get an extra wasp and the wasps have a lifespan as well. If I hover over any of the colonies then um, I can see statistics uh, of each each colony. Uh, there I can see the, how, how many tick cycles uh, the colony has been alive and the colony dies when it reaches zero ants. So it can't produce any more ants. The ants only return food to the colony they were spawned at. They all know which colony created them and they will only return food to that colony. Okay, thank you for watching my video. Um, I would welcome feedback on my simulation and any suggestions to improve it would be more than appreciated. If you enjoyed the video give it a like and subscribe to my fledgling channel. Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs>